How's it going, everyone? Ever Air Gaming Gear, another exciting episode for more Dragon Ball Z Kakarot plus a new power waiting set on the Nintendo Switch. So, last time, guys, if we just uh, finished on completing all of the other sub story. So far, so good. Turns out that uh, we just uh, finished on doing a uh, grilling sub story, and including the other uh, turtle, which we are uh, like gathering up a ten of the other uh, great energetic fish, and the, and just to to trade the other uh, farmer some of it because it uh, turns out. That uh, we received the other uh, royal tomatoes just to go ahead and bring all three of the supplies to the turtle. And that being said, we can go ahead and like um, do more uh, exploration around here. Because um, we're not going to go ahead and uh, like knock out to uh, take on one of this uh, base right now. Let's just uh, continue on forward to the main story. So we're going to head on back to the West City and we are going to go and talk to the Baltimore. So that we can go ahead and accept the mission just to go and take on to outer space just so that we can uh, start by uh, heading to a planet Namek. So without further ado, let's just go and of course set on back there and do some more uh, exploration there because turns out because uh, we are solving a lot of good deeds around here. So um, we, we can barely go at and uh, and see what this uh, next story will take place at, at while we uh, go and uh, check in with uh, Boma. Right now we're going to have to want to see to ourselves because it's uh, a bit of more of this a uh, proportion because uh, we just um because we, we just don't uh, want to be ready for it because it's it's gonna be like a, another this uh, excitement happening. So uh, let's just go ahead and take the dip and go talk to Baltimore. Just the person I was looking for. Huh? What's up, Bulma? We're gearing up to go to Namek, right? I'm working on the spaceship that's gonna get us there. But I'm short on parts. Oh, bummer. With Goku in the hospital practically mummified in bandages. You're the only one left for the job. Oh, no problem, Bulma. Leave it to me. That's the spirit. Here's what I need. Okay, so we need the, um, the hover right, the, uh, Hallucium and the what's it? The Vermifite? Vermifite. Is that how you pronounce it? Think you can handle that? Okay, do we have all of that? Okay, finding items. While moving on the field, use L to search your surroundings for key and detect that where you can find materials and other items. The location of the items that will glow when detected and, and the color of the glow indicate that what you can find there. Yellow, deer, wolves, and other animals, fruit trees, red, red animals, purple, destroyable boxes, rocks, and other objects. I see. Okay, so this is the interplanetary prep. Collect parts uh, from, from the uh, space pod. Alright, so let's go ahead and have a look. So we see because there are a couple of these uh, spare parts that uh, are somewhere around here in this whole city. So uh, if we go ahead and scroll, well, actually, you know what? Uh, we can just go ahead and follow the compass. Well, we don't actually have to keep on pressing on select just to go and view the uh, whole map. All right. Well, eventually, we got to these orbs that we can start by collecting. I mean, there are more of these that collectible because if we get uh, play more power up in case we wanted to go ahead and. And like uh, level up just to uh, increase our uh, amount of attack while we're at the skill tree. So hold on. I, I think I can handle this. So it's somewhere at this green spot somewhere. Okay, so we are not detecting any more sign of robot activities. So let's go ahead and run down these hills. Okay, so we'll go ahead and uh, move around some. Okay, so talking to you, it's a night to uh, reminisce, uh, but, but visit places from mo moment past every once in a while. You want to visit a place like that, don't you? I can uh, help you uh, find one, you know. Okay, so do we want to pursue the uh, memorial spot information? Cost 1,000 zenny. I mean, sure, let's pursue it. Excellent. And it seems like you got enough money, let's begin the reading. Okay, memorable spot for the, this area have been marked on your map. It should be the place. It's up to you to you whether you go there now or later. 
Um, we'll cave him. So, you know what? Let's go and have a look. Well, I'm not entirely sure where the uh, the rest of these material can be hiding. So, let's see. What do we pick up here? Okay, well, we're not looking for D metal. Okay, well, I'm just gonna keep looking around. Okay, so there's something down there. What we get here? This is one of them, right? Okay, so that is the uh, the herbal right we need we we need to get. Okay, so let's go look for the second. So the second one should be down this center. Okay, so let's just uh oh, come on now. How do you get here that fast? All right, come on. Okay, so we took the beating out of you. All right, so we're down to two more. And the last robot. Okay, so we take a separate gas. Well, it's fine. I mean, robots can come and det detect you, and you have to take um take appropriate action because. They're, they're just they want to start by challenging you to a fight because that's a part of RPGs and that how it goes. I mean, you just uh, gotta take appropriate action. Simple that way. Okay, guys, I'm not gonna tell you. So you were supposed to go use your um, your key sense just to, to go and vision to see where the um, the, the rest of these materials are. So uh, let's see what we we'll get here. Okay, so that is the um, the rumor fight that we um, that we collected. So let's go ahead and get the last one. So the last one I gotta be somewhere down this area. Okay, so let's figure out where it was. Okay, so it's somewhere in these rocks. So let's go ahead and collect that. So we go pick this up. So that is everything. Okay, so the last one is the uh, Molusium that we uh that we finished collecting. So let's go ahead and report back to the to uh, the Boma by heading back to West City. So that we fly super high. Alright, so we're just gonna go and um, move around these rods because I know because um, a couple of these are rods are uh, like um, a lot of these um, these hills that you gotta go and climb onto because it's just like you can just go hiking in these mountains. So um, let's just go ahead and take this uh, appropriate landing and we can uh, have a word with Bulma again. Talk about speedy service. Does everything check out? Okay, so you hand it over the material needed to Bulma. <laughs> sure does. Great job. I'll have this spaceship up and running in no time. Thanks a bunch, Bulma. Okay, so now we have Bulma added to our soul emblem. Okay, you got development that community leader Bulma and I'll unlock a new community board. Awesome. Okay, so something about development community. In this community, you can activate community skills that help with development. Build up this community if you are looking to increase your physical levels and the ability as well as reduce it by the cost of part development. Nice. Okay then, so we can go ahead and press on back. Alright, so... Now this next story says here, um... Oh, wait a minute. It's still the same thing. Okay. Well, just making sure that, that I'm not going to read that. Alright. So, this is it. It's finally done. The spaceship is complete and ready for takeoff. Alright, Gohan. Just let me know when you're ready to launch. We won't be back on Earth anytime soon, so make sure you've got everything you need. R right! Well, I'm pretty sure I got everything I need, so let's have a word. So, you all set for the trip? Yep, all set. Let's continue the first story. Okay, I'll just perform a few final checks and make my way over to Kame House. You go ahead and meet up with Krillin and the others. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I just keep on saying Kame's house. I think I, he, she meant Kame's house. Okay, well, what's the difference? I, I just uh, kept on mispronouncing that. So, um, yes, here's our spin point. So, we did, uh, level up to 20. And, uh, that being said, we're ready to go and 
blast off to outer space. All right, because um, we, I mean, we we no longer have to go and see Earth, and longer as we um, and longer as we get back. I mean, there's uh more things happening in the, in the new planet at the planet Namek because that's where Piccolo people live, perhaps, and you know, we we might as well see what what where it takes place at. With their preparations for the journey to planet Nemec complete, everyone is gathered at Kame House. <laughs> What's with the hair, go on? My mom thought I should look more presentable. You know, when meeting an entire alien race for the first time. Ah, uh, okay. Man, your mom sure is strict. We're counting on you. Don't come back until you've found those Dragon Balls. On it. Bye, Grandpa. Bye, Mom. Write me every day, Gohan! Alright, time for takeoff! Watch out, Planet Namek, here we come! Meanwhile, just as Bulma and the others left for Planet Namek, Vegeta, back and fully recovered from his fight on Earth, learned of his Commander Frieza's absence. Frieza was on his way to planet Nemec with his most elite subordinates in tow. He was in search of the Dragon Balls that he learned of from Vegeta and the others on Earth. His goal? To wish for immortality. Vegeta hurriedly made his way to Nemec in an effort to catch Frieza and stop him. If Frieza is able to attain immortality, the universe is history! I'm not going to let that happen. Those Dragon Balls are mine! Okay, well, it turns out that the Vegeta is, um, is just being too greedy for Dragon Balls, to be honest. Well, anyway, that being said, well, it's interesting to, to go ahead and, like, um, listen to the narrator uh, read its, um, its summary of what the, the story is going on about, because um, we already knew already, because... Um, Rathrita is uh, taking command of his uh, elite forces. Meanwhile, 34 days after Bulma and the others left Earth, they finally arrived at their destination, Planet Namek. We did it! We actually made it to Planet Namek! Hmm, this place kind of reminds me of where Piccolo trained me, back on Earth. No use waiting around, let's find those Dragon Balls. Oh, hey, check this out! I'm picking something up, no doubt about it, it's a Dragon Ball! You're right! Woohoo! <laughs> right. Oh, right! We found we one! Found we one. found one! Huh? Krillin, do you feel that strong energy over there? Huh? Man, you're not kidding. It's massive, and it feels crazy strong. And there's something kind of evil about it, too. Uh, what's going on? There's nothing to freak out about. Besides, look at the reading I'm getting over there. The radar's picking up four Dragon Balls all in one spot. Uh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> it's probably just some Namekians. We got nothing to be afraid of. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I feel like I've seen that ship somewhere before. It's a Saiyan spaceship! I knew it! Go on, lower your power level. They'll know we're here. Yeah. It's... Vegeta, looks like it's just him. I am not letting you get your filthy hands on those Dragon Balls, Frieza! Bulma, let the others know what's going on. And then, head back to Earth. We'll stay here and gather the rest of the Dragon Balls. 
Gohan, sound good to you? Y yeah. Uh, okay. I'll get a hold of Master Roshi and fill him in first. Once I'm back, I'll pick Goku up and bring him here. I should be back in about two months. Uh, right. Two months. Mm -hmm. What? Uh, another one? Hold the phone. What's another one of those things doing here? Uh, yeah, that's exactly what I want to know! And that is something we need to investigate? We found it, Lord Frieza! Excellent work. Now only three remain out of my grasp. <laughs> Take care not to lose that, Dodoria. It seems Vegeta is looking for the Dragon Balls as well. Yes, sir! Uh, pardon me, Lord Frieza. Kui has just intercepted Vegeta. Has he? My, that was fast. In addition, uh, the two large power sources from earlier have suddenly disappeared as well. I will make my way to their location and investigate. I should be able to identify them shortly. Very well, but I'm more concerned about ridding myself of that traitor Vegeta. What a shame. I didn't think him foolish enough to turn against me, let alone attempt to steal the Dragon Balls for himself. Kui should be on his way to dispose of Vegeta. Should be interesting, those two have long hated each other. They are roughly equal in power, I believe. So I assume it'll take a fair bit of time. You're not going anywhere, Vegeta. I'm going to enjoy blowing you to pieces. Right. Make sure to let Goku and the others know. Thanks. All right, I'm heading back to Earth now. Good luck, you two. I'll be back with Goku as fast as I can. <gasps> Krillin! Someone's coming! Huh? Is it the Saiyan? No. It's not Vegeta. It's someone weaker. Probably a Namekian. It should be right around here. Huh? Look. What the hell is that? What? Oh, those aren't Namekians! They don't look like Namekians! Who the hell are they? Their power levels are a joke! They're nothing but trash! I guess it's just some Taurus, huh? Well, anyway, we got orders to annihilate everyone on the planet. It wouldn't be much fun if they got away. So let's take care of that spaceship of theirs. Sounds good to me! No! That starship! <laughs> Sucks to be them! Guess they were in the wrong place at the wrong time! Okay, Gohan. Feel free to let loose on these guys! They're nothing compared to you! Here goes! Right! Okay, so we are finding some of these, um... These Frieza henchmen now. Okay. So, just take a look at them. Well, they aren't looking to be like, uh, Namekians. But, um... Turns out because it's a, one of the Frieza's force officers, it's a what they used to be called. Okay, let's go for um for the sledge. Okay, so we're gonna keep going. Okay, so I'm using Masenko. Okay, so we're gonna judge all of his flash. Alright, and then we're gonna keep sucking up the fight. Alright, that's it. So we did earn our rank gas. So we're feeling a little bit half stronger. Yeah. Hey! Nice going, Gohan! Nice going? There's nothing nice about this!
Uh, Lord Frieza, it seems like those two power sources from before may warrant more of our attention. They raised their power levels almost instantly, and then vanished after defeating two of our scouts. That is indeed strange. I highly doubt it's Vegeta's doing. Correct, my lord. It can't be Vegeta. The sources each have a power level of about 1,500. 1,500, is that right? Hardly anything worthy of our concern, wouldn't you say? They do seem rather unruly. If you happen upon these two, eliminate them. Let us leave Vegeta's destruction to Queen. <laughs> you hear that, Vegeta? That was a direct order from Lord Frieza. I finally get to kill you. Don't make me laugh, Kui. Do you actually think you can beat me? <laughs> Are you blind, Vegeta? Take a look at your scouter. You'll see my power level is leagues above yours. <laughs> no point waiting for his attack. I'll just hunt him down and blow him to bits. Hmm? Okay, well, what's gonna be the problem? That's Frieza ship! <laughs> <laughs> it really is my lucky day. Not only do I get to the rip we uh, limb from limb, but I get to the scrap Frieza ship too. Alright, so as you can see, we are players of Vegeta now. Alright, find Queen and uh, put him. Okay, find Queen and uh, put him in his place. Alright, well, that will have to wait for later, you guys. So, uh, next time on Dragon Ball Z Crack Right, we're gonna play uh, a little of uh, Vegeta. And go ahead and put a, a stop to uh, the Kui on the next series, you guys. So you don't go anywhere and you will be particular and stay tuned on the next video. So thank you guys so much for taking the time to enjoy the episode. So if you're liking the series and you want to see more of Dragon Ball Z Kakarot, be sure to leave an every type of like, share the video, and subscribe. If you do subscribe to the channel, please do ring that notification bell so that you'll be stay up there and notified to when my new and awesome videos up in the way. So just make sure you guys stay tuned in. And uh, that will have to do it. So thank you guys so much for tuning in and watching this episode. We will be picking them more in the next one. So take care, you guys. I hope to talk to you on the next video.